Okay, so guys, the Hummer H3, its power steering pump went out. We rode it around for a while, and I guess that damaged uh, the pulley somehow because the pulley just broke off on us down the interstate. So we had to order a Hummer H3 pump. We couldn't order the pulley, so this pulley is actually a Colorado pulley, and we were going to try it and see if it would work, but it doesn't. So... Um, let me show you here. Uh, it's kind of a dilemma because you can't buy a Hummer H3 pulley anywhere, not even a junkyard. I've searched the entire U.S. So, see, it's a press-on type pulley and there's too much play with the Colorado pulley on the H3 pump. So what we're going to do is keep the pulley for the Colorado, return the H3 pump, and get a Colorado pump. Because that shaft on the H3 pump is just too narrow for that Colorado pulley. Alright guys, so update, we have the Colorado pump and the Colorado pulley installed on the Hummer H3 and it is working great and I will show you. Alright guys, here it is installed. This is the Chevy Colorado power steering pump and power steering pulley installed on the H3. No modifications were needed. It bolted up the same way the original one did on the H3. Even the uh, power steering cap from the H3 fits on the Colorado's pump and it's like a brand new vehicle now uh, it's probably better than it ever was before honestly so it's a little cheaper I think it was 80 some dollars versus the H3 pump it was like 130 160 so this will work for you all you will need two quarts of power steering fluid so guys, I hope this has helped.